in this video we are going to discuss the logic app and this is the third video for this logic app so i would recommend please uh, visit uh, my previous video on the logic app to get the better understanding so uh, what is the logic flow uh, so logic flow is the is the way by which you can create the automated workflow as a serverless mechanism so you no need to provision yourself everything would be taken care of by the azure what about the scalability, elasticity, high availability, everything they will take care. So I have explained in my previous video what is the workflow in detail. So I would recommend please visit the previous video. That link is coming on the top to better understanding what is the workflow. And then these are the things about the logic app. This is the serverless workflow. We have the visual designer by which you can create the logic app end-to-end -end workflow very easily. We have that many triggers by which you can trigger right and these are the few more points on the logic app so everything i have explained in the first video let us show the uh, the demo part what demo we are going to show so we create one http request and those request the data should go to the my table storage account table and then should be the response so that's it for this demo let us move to the azure account so i hope you have all the subscribe for valid subscriptions with the Azure account and valid subscription. So now first what you have to do, you have to create the storage account because we need the one table, right? So we can create the storage account here or you can type, you go here or the services and type the storage account. I need the storage account because I have to create one with the table, right? So click here. I'm going to use this YouTube remote demo resource group and keep the storage account name, right? YouTube S account. And just review and click. And once it's done, we have to create one table also. And table is we know as uh, if you want to know more about the storage uh, account, I would recommend please visit my previous video on the Azure Store account to get all detail about the container, blobs, table, cube, everything. So here we have to wait to deployment done. Then we have to create one table, and those table would be using into the Azure app and here you have to come to the table and you have to create one table YouTube demo table and hit the OK button that's it now come here and we have to go to the services and we have to come the click here and type logic app we get the logic app so what we have to do first we have to create one http request and response after checking these things should be insert the table so logic app you have to use the consumption for the service service facility resource group yeah youtube resource group give the name youtube table logic app review it and hit that create button and it's very easy to create the logic app with the help of the designer on logic app so this is logic app page so when you come the first time you will get this video and it sees so many triggers are there but this time you are going to create the and the other templates see these are the many templates but you are going to create the logic app by own so what you have to do to create the http request so first you have to create the type the request to get the request trigger this one and come here we want the method 
we want the this method we appear here and we want the post method because you have to send many more things right and we have to create the schema means when you post the http what information you are passing so there are the easy way to create the schema you copy your schema you copy your data and with the help of this they will create the schema automatically so click on the here post your data and see we create the schema right so now this part is done second part we have to create this response come here and type the response we get the response here so in response what are you going i am going to respond what we are getting i am go going to add this uh, hello name is there i will say name and your country is with the country name okay and message is that's just i want to test about this thing and click here on the save as this is the post so you have to use some uh, tools to use send the post right on clicking here you can make the up and down right so this is the path copy this path go to the post main post the path here and also you have to come on the header and you have to add one thing content type is the J application JSON. then come on the body raw and this message is already there and if you don't want just to remove it and take the flash copy here and send if you get the message what i got that time then it's is working request and response you see here we know then your country is us and the message is these things right it means working everything fine and whether it work or not you can also see here come to your logic app this is your logic app right here we have the run history so if you refresh it you can see that this has been executed right if you click here it will show you that all the part of your logic app has been executed see tick tick both giving is working right? now come to here and go to the designer again and i have to add one table right so click this press button add the action and say azure table storage and what you want to do you have to do the insert or merge in that you have to choose and the connection name now they are asking the connection name means which table is the which storage account is there so it was the youtube connection storage right or logic table connection you have to use this one yeah or you can give any name so this is just name and this account is here right this is my account now it asking the which table so table name is the youtube table that we have created and you know the partition key it wants so you can use these the dynamic expressions here you come here and you put guid this one I want here so click here then come and click ok you got it and I want the row key also the same thing click here ok button you got it right and JSON how to make the JSON so what you have to do ok and say name colon 
again give the barcode i will feel better then subject comma message then subject and then now come here on the name this one and click the name here it will go automatically and subject also subject that's why drag drop you no need to write a code here message subject came two times no need to pass the two times subject country with the country that's it done save it some mistake is there so validation name is okay subject is okay message is okay and country is not okay right so you have to put here in double code country okay that's it so now save it it's done now we want to go the test so this time again go the post main same url just hit it so this time I got the response means I got this part for this table part you have to go the table so you have to use this storage preview I came into the storage account and come to the storage preview and if you come the table and you see your message see uh, this is the country US message everything here right so that's why we done end to end uh, this exercise so i would request please visit all the videos for the logic app to get the more understanding thank you very much and please don't forget to uh, subscribe this channel a lot of effort goes behind to create the and also i will get motivated to see your subscriptions thank you